great good news story to start off. It's been a week since the regular Wednesday chapel at Asbury University in Kentucky. Well, it turned into something far more. It turned into the manifest presence of God. God has been moving among the students and faculty, and people are traveling to the university to join in this move of God. Well, one student told CBN News he prays this revival when, will encourage churches and pastors and stir up a hunger for the Lord. Wendy Griffith brings us the story from Wilmore, Kentucky. The revival here at Asbury is now in its sixth night as hundreds of people have come from near and far to just enjoy the presence of God. Even though it's almost midnight, this auditorium is still packed with people that are still coming in. In the last two evenings, we've estimated well over 3,000 people that are here and at these different locations uh, to worship the Lord. Were you prepared for this? No, uh, there is no, there's no playbook for this. And we're still trying to create some space for what's happening here. And so that's a delicate balance and we're trying to manage that as thoughtfully and faithfully as we can and just steward what's happening on campus. <laughs> skeptical at first just because growing up with my church we never had anything like this and so I just wasn't used to the idea of a revival um, but the longer it's gone on I've realized that if God wants it to happen it's gonna happen my prayer is that this will encourage churches encourage pastors encourage disbelievers um, and just stir up a hunger for the Lord because again it's not it's not about Asbury it's about Jesus the fire that started here at Asbury is reportedly spreading as students from nearly two dozen other college campuses have come here to take part in the services. And what God started here a week ago is showing no signs of stopping. Wendy Griffith, CBN News, Asbury University in Wilmore, Kentucky. Well, apparently it's infectious. Lee University is already seeing a similar move. I know of many universities sending delegations there in hopes that they can catch it and bring it back. Uh, and if you want to catch it, I think it's online, so you can watch. You don't have to go to Kentucky for it. And realize this, God is always all around us. He is always waiting for us. We keep asking him, when are you going to pour yourself out over us? And he keeps saying, well, when are you going to receive it? When are you going to take the time to come and just sit at my feet and let me pour into you? You can have revival every day. You can have Jesus 24 hours a day. It all depends on are you hungry? Are you thirsty? If you are, if you seek him first, then you'll find him. Well, we're going to have an in-depth report on the Asbury Revival on Friday's 700 Club. Uh, so stay tuned for that. We want to cover this and how it's going to spread. Uh, I, my prayer is this spreads uh, across the nation and around the world. If anything we need right now, we need more of Jesus.